All right, so let's go start with our first SSRS project. So SQL Server Reporting Services. So I'm going to go to my start here in my PC. So I'm working in a PC in Windows 10. Here, you can be working in a virtual machine. Uh, here, I'm going to open my Visual Studio 2017 SSDT. If you follow the videos on installation, you can see that uh, my is a standalone version. I'm going to open that. Here I have my window open. So now uh, that I have my data tools here open, I'm going to select, if you have done all the installation and add all the um, other functionalities, you should be able to see uh, the uh, reporting services. So the file, you're gonna create a new project. Uh, I'm going to call this test cells. You can call this any way you want. So before I put my name here, I'm, I'm going ahead a little bit. So let me go and look this. So you selected to create a new project. If your window is like that and you cannot find the reporting, just go to see what you have installed here. And I can see that I have analysis services, reporting, and business intelligence. So I'm going to use the reporting services. And for reporting reporting services, I have two selections. I have I can uh, start my project with using a wizard or the reporting service project. So I'm going to use this. It's a basic report. So I'm going to use the report service project. The second thing that I'm going to do is give a name to my project, make sure that the project has a unique name. And I here in the location, I'm going to make sure that either I browse to put this in a place that I can find it, or I copy this and put it in a notepad so I can know where my uh, projects are being saved. All right. So I'm going to create this, and this is the window that comes once you have created a project. So we have created a project called Test Cells, right? And uh, the next step will be creating a report.